Good afternoon, friends. Stephen Benoon here with Israeli News Live. And uh, friends, listen to listen just for a moment here. I have kind of avoided getting into the subject of asteroids and things like that. Getting into this story, uh, subject of asteroids here on Israeli News Live. Because we have so many things that change, it's, it's just like war, it's very fluid. Uh, and I say fluid because they can talk about an asteroid going to strike the Earth, but yet we have technology that we're able to steer them, we're able to destroy them. Uh, a lot of things can change before an impact occurs. And this one reason why the government never really tells us about what's coming. Uh, a lot of different reasons for that. I did though last night, I released a video on Patreon about three different asteroids that are coming our way this year and I was very careful in that video to explain that um, we are actively working to try to chip away at them, move them out of orbit, things like that so that they don't hit the earth. So. In that respect there, I would say there's not any major cause of alarm. But at the same time, if they are unsuccessful in their campaign on this one particular asteroid, it's going to hit the Pacific sub, sub, uh, Subsubduction Zone, which is going to trigger the fault line and the quakes for the Cascadia, things like that. It's going to be catastrophic if we can't manage to get this thing off course or break it apart and they are actively working on breaking it apart so i want you to be aware of that they are actively working on it um our patreon channel you get more information about this uh, i'll go in, i go into more details about it i don't want to say too much here just mainly because it's not always received very well and um and like i said and it's because things are always changing Initially, and just to give you an idea of that change, initially this asteroid was supposed to hit near Cuba. And, um, but because of them trying to chip away at it, they have knocked it out of its orbit to some degree. And it shifted and now it's going to the sub, uh, subseduction zone there uh, in the Pacific Ocean. It is big as of right now. And uh, I don't have a time frame for it as of yet, but I know it's this year, at least that's what I've been told initially. Uh, and all three of them, they're traveling together. There's more than three, but the, the three that, that are supposed to impact the Earth are all traveling together. They're not planet killers, nothing like that. But because of the subduction zone, they do believe that it's going to cause the, uh, the faults to go off at the Cascadia, and we could end up seeing some major quakes. I'm Steve Benoon. You're watching Israeli News Live. Thank you.